I certainly hope that rude C7 unit didn't send you over here. Those more recent models have no etiquette programming whatsoever. I think he should be replaced or shipped down to maintenance to direct droids there. But I cannot seem to convince my masters of the logic of the request. Oh, I wouldn't go that far, despite what others would say. A number designation for a C7 unit means far more than an integer increase. Some droids undergo radical changes with each generation. Each numeric jump in sequence can have wide-ranging changes in functionality and temperament. But then, you are a new model yourself. I wouldn't expect you to understand how it feels. Now, was there something I could help you with? I see. Well, good day to you then. I'm sorry, but only authorized cargo droids are allowed into the warehouse. No. In fact, I do not have you on my list of Kodin's acquisitions. How did you get in here? I see. Well, I have no current use for you. I'll assign you to C6E3. He needs the help to make up. If you do not wish to... Good. Yes, what is... Shouldn't you be getting back to... Oh, you're back. That C7... I would be happy to help you, but as long... Well, if the C7 unit would... Yes, I would... Yes, what is it? You can't be serious. I am not in... How dreadful.
Oh my, you startled me. What are you doing here? I monitor the transponder codes of all ships leaving the docks. Then transmit departure information for any of Vaga. The information is sent to... Oh, I see. In that case, I will... You're welcome. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must go back to monitoring the traffic. Who are you? You're not supposed to be here. Confident statement. You have the list of Voga's launch codes. You will give these to us now, or else we will be forced to take drastic action. Surprised statement. You are foolish to think we will allow you to take... Amused query. I think you will find the odds are somewhat... Incredulous statement. There you are. What kept you? Yeah, I know there's droids in the warehouse. So what? He says he's got the transponder codes to Vogus freighters. One that can be picked up by... There's bound to be someone in the refugee sector who can realign the Ebon Hawk's ID. <laughs> yeah, right. You're the one who wanted to say... Look at Kamara and also run with no chubby. Do... Harley, it's what you want to talk to no run the manacan. Then I bear with... Yes! <laughs> 
Gay reactor cement being a rugu to and the chuchu. Gay rintu rintu walk away quick. Tere wana jun konata delo. Dosane. Tere wana jun konata delo era guno atuna. expecting someone taller. I hope you are not in too much pain to hear my words and understand them. I am Goto, one of the officials representing a percentage of non-sanctioned trading here in both the YouTube system and Republic Space. And I had a question for you. Are you a Jedi? That is 
is unfortunate. Still, perhaps you have some value. I have gone to considerable expense and effort to bring you here. It is because I have a job for you. Yes, but I am not in the habit of asking for things. And you were so difficult to find even after that small incident on Paragus. There is something important to me I need protected. The Republic, it is broken. What happened on Paragus has set in motion events that I can no longer control. Not to be melodramatic, but I fear it has broken the galaxy irrevocably. This has occupied much of my attention, and there seems to be no predictable way to resolve the situation. In one standard month, the Republic will collapse. Not due to war or secession, but because it lacks the infrastructure to support itself. It is unknown to all but a few, but the Sith won the Jedi Civil War. Even with their supposed victory, the war left the Republic on the brink of collapse. Rather than remain and help solidify the Republic, however, Revan chose to leave known space. A frustrating turn of events, as a rallying figurehead could have done much to restore order. There is something moving in the galaxy that lies beyond the ability of my instruments to detect or predict. I believe it to be a legacy of the Sith, but I have been unable to determine the source. Whatever this presence is, it is staging strikes at key figures throughout the Republic, and through some unknown means, it is causing the destruction of worlds. Qatar, a Miraluka world in the Mid-Rim was one such place. I have reason to suspect there was a gathering of Jedi on that world when it was rendered lifeless. I cannot find any pattern in these attacks, and it is a source of frustration to me. There is some clue, however, that perhaps the Jedi are linked to these attacks, or that the targets are significant in some way I have yet to discover. You misunderstand me. I do not wish to stop the Sith any more than I wish to stop the Jedi. It is simply important to me that the infighting amongst these Jedi religious branches be resolved so the galaxy may be put back together. I do not care which one triumphs. I only want the universe to settle down for a while, catch its breath. All these constant crises are getting somewhat repetitive. You could say I am something of a patriot. Although I was unable to serve during the troubles with the Mandalorians or against the aggressors known as Malak and Revan, I am able and willing to serve now. The problem is I can find no side to choose. Both are hidden from me as they seem to be hiding from each other. Irritating. It is like a Dejaric board where neither player can see the other, nor see all the pieces. It is not a fair game, an equitable game. If you care nothing for the Republic, perhaps finding the source of these Sith and resolving the situation would be to our mutual benefit. There is no margin for error when I say that these Sith seek to murder you and all Jedi everywhere. They have been quite deficient. And when they dispose of you, there will be nothing left to stop them, and the galaxy will fall under their influence. Understand, I merely wished the situation resolved. If the Sith are the more capable of both parties, then it is only logical that they fill the vacuum the Jedi and the Senate cannot. I am a businessman. The Republic needs stability to survive, prosper, and grow. Whether it is led by the Sith or supported by the Jedi is of no consequence to me. It is the proximity alarm. We are under attack. 
Somehow, your allies have found you. Unexpected. You will remain here, under guard. I must see to the defense of my ship. Announcement. We seek to make Goto aware of our services, allowing us to facilitate communication and terminate hostilities in the galaxy. If that means blowing up planets, slaughtering entire species, or allying ourselves with the Sith, then that is the logical choice. Our predecessor would never understand our directives. He was slow, weak, and his vocabulator was prone to static. <laughs> Thank you. 